are going to go up to Lightroom Preferences. You're going to go ahead and show Lightroom Presets folder. Double click on Lightroom. You'll see the local adjustment presets. Double click on that. This is where all your adjustment brushes are. You're going to minimize the screens. Go to your zip file of the brushes. Double click. Creates a new file with the brushes inside. Control A to copy all or you can right click and copy 15. Right click and paste. And paste your items in there. If you have any duplicates, you can click apply all and skip as I did. Close your windows. You're going to go back into your Lightroom. Now we are going to open up these brushes. I have a photo up of a portrait. I just need to smooth some skin, brighten the eyes, do a few adjustments that my presets can't do for me. I like to pair them side by side so I can see the difference before and after. Zoom out a little bit so you can see the full photo. Go to my adjustment brush. From the down bar, I'm going to go ahead and click my skin smoothing. This gives a nice, light, smooth skin. It still keeps a lot of the texture, brightens a tiny bit, but doesn't soften too much. I'm going to go ahead and paint that on all over her skin, avoiding her lips and eyes, eyebrows, and hair. You can use your uh, left and right brackets on your keyboard to increase and decrease the size of your brush. Once you have that all painted in, you can see it's quite a bit smoother. We're going to go to new. We're going to go to our drop down bar and we are going to brighten and sharpen the eyes with our brighten eyes preset. We're going to go new and now we are going to sharpen her eyebrows and her eyelashes. Kind of emphasizes the eyes, brings a lot of detail. Sometimes I use that right over um, the iris as well. Helps to keep the eyes nice and sharp and bright. And the last thing we are going to do is we are going to go ahead and lighten her under eyes. Go to our under eye preset brush. Click new. We go to down to the bottom of the under eyes. We're going to run that right along under her eyes just to brighten her eyes a little bit more, bring a little bit more emphasis to her eyes. And as you can see, in just a few seconds to about a minute and a half, we can definitely give this portrait um, a little bit more of a softer finished feel. Her eyes are now bright. Her skin is even. Uh, her eyes pop quite a bit more. It doesn't look like too much, but just enough to give it that finished feel. You can go through and apply uh, any of your presets now.